Hello, my hearties. It's just me, Scotty McClue. I thought we'd have a quick pop-up this Friday morning. It's just gone half past seven, and a lot of you will be rushing out to work. Some of you will be jumping into the shower or the bath, and um, there'll be all that going on. But I thought, no, we'll have a quick pop-up and just say hi to whoever is about. I think that's what's important, and I think that's what matters. It's, uh, it's good that we can all get together just before another day's work. There's Chaz Boy has just joined us. Hi, Chaz Boy. Lovely to have you with us and a big dinky-doo, of course, this Friday morning. Yes, Friday the 19th of January. The 19th of January, my mother's 99th birthday. Bless her. She's no longer with us, but we send her love and heavenly blessings, I say to you. Uh, there we are. Did you cry when Nicola Sturgeon got arrested? Do you know, Dave, I can't remember. Obviously, every day would be very emotionally moved with the suddenness of the news, I would think. Uh, so there you are. But um, I'm not generally given two tears, I have to say. Uh, Lily says, hi, Dick, you know. There we go. Scotty's got an Alex Salmon poster above his bed. <laughs> <laughs> How marvellous is that? No, no, I'm not political at all, as everyone well knows. So there you are. How are you, says Lily? Lily, fantastic. Thank you for coming and joining us this Friday morning. So lovely to have you with us on the TikTok Live, I say to you. Get following as soon as you can. There's a Rangers Chelsea. Uh, Loyal Media has followed us. So do come and join us as soon as you all possibly can. And I say to you, Dinky, do a very good morning. How lovely to have you with us. Hello, says Newcastle. Hello, Newcastle. How lovely to have you. We are there. That's the stuff. Thanks, says Lily. No, thank you, Lily. And um, Oscar has just joined us. Oscar says, hi. We say, hi, Oscar. How lovely to have you with us, I say to you. Ryan has joined us. I'm happy it's the last day of school this week, says Lily. I know, but you're in school for a long time, so learn how to love it and enjoy it. Yes, indeed. Rusty signs himself the fat controller. I remember reading about you in the Thomas the Tank Engine books, Rusty, and good to hear from you. Uh, so there you are. Good morning from Scotland. Good morning, Michelle. How lovely to have you with us from Scotland. I love you live, says Newcastle. Newcastle, you are very, very kind. It's so very good of you. So there we go. Good morning. Uh, bro, you're my favourite TikToker, says ZP. How do you like football um well i don't play it now you know i don't get a game for rangers or celtic or man U. Uh, so there you have it hi from the west midlands says brant's morning from yorkshire says imogen good morning imogen how lovely to have you with us welcome to scotty McClue live this is the big one so there we go rusty let's get rid of people like you um, we don't like half wits like that. So there we go. Gone, gone, gone. Wonderful. Yes, people with very low lives. I tell you. Uh, morning from Sussex, says Blanche. Good morning, Blanche. Uh, lovely to have you with us. And did you do Star? Star Aim is giving me red roses. How very, very kind. I say, what a lovely, lovely thing to do. Guys, get sharing this and, of course, get following as soon as you can. If you're a member of the human race, you should actually be following Scotty McClue on TikTok. Yes, there's no reason not to, I say to you. Uh, good morning, everybody, I say to you. Hi, Scotty, how are you doing? Hi from Ayrshire. Lovely to have you with us from Ayrshire, I say to you. How amazing is that? I love this. Some comments in this live were filtered to protect the community's experience. That just means that TikTok have booted them down the swanee. We love it. Fantastic. Morning from an icy Glasgow. Michael, very, very cold, I believe, in Scotland this morning. Morning, Scotty. Dinky do Jack. How lovely to have you with us. And lovely London says good morning. Good morning, London. I hope all is well. This is London. That's the way the BBC used to start their news. I tell you, Marty from Fife of Scotland, Star Aim, have sent me 
10 red roses. There's a little rose goal there if you're feeling flush, but you never, ever have to give anything. Yes, that's the lovely thing about it. Morning from five, says Aidan. Take you to Aidan. I tell you. Uh, hello, what time is it for you? It's 7.36 in the morning. So we'll not be up terribly long, I say to you. Hi, do you like steak? I don't like steak, no. I love, love steak. I tell you, see what I just did there. Ah, yes, indeed. What a distinguished gentleman. A good day, sir. Greg, a good day to you, sir. How lovely to have you with us. Good morning. Good luck to Bonnie Ro Rose versus Falkirk tomorrow in the Scottish Cup tie. Liam and Ryan from Bonnie Rig. We love Bonnie Rig. Good luck, guys, in the Scottish Cup tie. Morning from Fife in Scotland. Morning, Fife. Ken, uh, there's a poll on my YouTube channel, guys, and it is, is it Anne Struther or Einster? You pronounce the Fife Village. Where can I buy the famous McClue's Pies? Bobby from Bears Den, every baker should have McClue's Pies. Go into your baker and shout, do you stock McClue's Pies? Do you stock the vegetarian lattice slice in the rich chicken sauce? That's what we need to say. The North Pole says Bionetta. Yes, says London. Lovely London. We love you from London. Which part of London? There we are. Guten Morgen, Scotty. Ja, ja, Peter. Guten Morgen, I say to you, Peter. In ich Deutsch sprechen, ich bin ein Auslander, ich verstehen. Uh, so what part of the world are you in, Scotty? I'm in the West Coast, Bonnie Rig. There we are. Good morning from Essex. But we have broadcast from the East Coast. I tell you that. Um, how are you? It's proper early. Oh, CBD expert. Proper early. Yes, this is what we call the early bud. Because obviously, we all have to get to work. I say to you, good morning for Newton Stewart. Oh, Diker, we love Newton Stewart. And we love Castle Douglas. And we love Kirkubre. Yes, all that sort of stuff down there. How beautiful is that? Uh, St. John's Town of Dorai. There we are. Maniv. Dumfries. How are you? Says lovely London. We're fantastic, lovely London. So there we go. Space Cowboy will let you go and sort yourself out. So there we have it. Yes, we'll say goodbye to Space Cowboy. He can go and sort his, his wee problem out. I think that's the important thing. What a marvellous badge you have on your old boy. Yes, that's uh, Scotty McClue, Dinky Doo. Uh, have the most wonderful day, you too, CBD expert. Good morning from Ireland, says Paddy Mullen. Good morning, Paddy Mullen. Top of the morning to you. How lovely to have you with us. Uh, you wake up so early. Oh, Dominic, yes. We have to be about. We have to. It's the early bird that catches the worm, which is interesting because it's usually the second mouse that gets the cheese. Did you know that one? Can you please sing the heart song? <coughs> um, this is my story. This is my song. Follow the hearts and never go wrong. What about that? I tell you, I'm in Newcastle. Queen Leanne, lovely to have you with us from Newcastle. How's you this morning? Not too bad. What about you? LMA says, hi, it's freezing, says Queen Leanne. It will, Newcastle knows how to do cold on a January morning. It could be Scottish. Uh, yes, indeed, you could indeed. Uh, Scotty McClure, hello, Rangers. Good morning, Scotty, how are you doing? Good morning from Kent. Keith, we love you in Kent. Where about in Kent are you? Are you in Broadstairs? Are you in Maidstone? Yes, you'll see I'm not just an athlete. Are you close to the Medway? Uh, good morning, good morning, everybody. Uh, Swale, oh, you're in Swale. Lovely, we send love to Kent. Fantastic, yes, indeed. Uh, good morning, everybody, love to have you. There's Ramsgate, am I right? Ramsgate, uh, there you are. Morning, Scotty. Morning, everybody. Lovely to have you with us and a massive, massive dinky do to you. I know you'll all be rushing. I know some of you will be jumping into the shower or the bath. 
a poor Guinness old boy. Gillano. Yes, indeed. London also very cold, says lovely London. Oh, yes, London can do you a bit of cold, but it can do you a bit of heat. I can remember just lying on the floor of my friend's flat one night in the summer. It was just so hot. And I told him when he came back here, I said, I've just been lying here, it's just so hot. He went, oh, well, we're basically in a mud flat. <laughs> it's thick snow here in Newcastle. Well, Queen Leanne will have to be very careful going out in it. I think you should stay in. I felt like Scotty Foos, your do's is mod. Peter Herens in Aberdeen, uh, up in the north east, where they've had a lot of snow. Quite a lot of snow. And uh, a lot of the roads have been closed. And up at uh, the A92, and the Cockbridge to Tom and Toll, the Braemar. All that kind of ruined about there, man, of field. And I, I tell you, old Meldrum, it's seriously called in Tindrum, says Jay. Jay, I used to call it Tindrum because my parents were our guy old people and we talked about, oh, I think he's up about Tindrum. But apparently it's Tindrum. You can settle the argument. What happened to your phone in? It was class back in the day. Clark, we've done it for 32 years. We still do it on a Saturday night at 9 o'clock sharp on TikTok and YouTube. So never miss it. 32 years, the phone in this year. Uh, so follow us as soon as you can. I think really the stations can't handle such a big audience because it attracted huge audiences. I mean huge. I mean, some radio stations are happy with maybe three or 4,000 people listening at night. I had quarter of a million every half hour. So the management have to be on their metal. And managers are not good at coming into a radio station. And there's a huge audience report. And then also a lot of people moaning. But I have got a... That thing at night, no, 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 no. <laughs> the half wits. But they're all listening. We used to say 50% loved me and 50% didn't. But 100% listened. And that was what it was about. How are you doing, says football? Did you do magic, says Clark Clark? Did you do Clark Clark? I said to you, this year I have been 40 years in media, 40 years in television and radio, and newspapers, and uh, what else, online advertising, all these things, there we are. Uh, YouTube, TikTok, we're on now, very, very big on TikTok, of course. Hello from Cornwall, Paul Glover. I love, I love having you there from Cornwall, fantastic. So there we're from Penzance, from uh, Dunnelly, from Elston, from uh, Truro, Truro, I says. There we go. Fantastic. Mausel. Yeah, Mausel, I says. Uh, fantastic. Have you heard of Tullibody, Scotty? Gee, the whole world has heard of Tullibody. We are talking out the hill foots. We're talking Alawa, Alva, Dollar, Main Street, uh, Blair Logie. Uh, Throsk, um, Alva, did we say Alva? I think we said Alva, didn't we? Yes, indeed. Of course we've heard of Tullibody. Fantastic, dinky do. Uh, hello from Leicester, Lorraine. We love Leicester. Beautiful part of the world. Yes, I used to go down there. Was it Oakhampton? Is, is, is that close? Greetings from Spain. Hola, hola. Me alamo, Scotty McClue. Lovely to have you with us. Greetings, I say to you. Uh, there's James, dinky do. James, lovely to have you with us. Everybody's joining us, guys. Get sharing. Get watching and sharing. If you want to, if you're feeling flushy, what stick a red rose in? There's a wee goal there, but you never, ever have to. All right. Very, very important. I need another 25 followers right now. Also spend the day subscribing to the Scotty McClue YouTube channel. You'll see it on there. So it's uh, yeah, very easy to find. It's youtube.com forward slash Scotty McClue. How hard is that? You can your country well, sir. Gee, we have to can our country well. It's a beautiful, stunningly beautiful country. Contribute to uh, make some comments on what you think of the little video 
Are you proud to be Scottish? It's up on TikTok and YouTube. All right, so there you go. You can't miss that. <laughs> the Scotty McClue Video Talk Show. That's the YouTube. Put that in, the Scotty McClue Video Talk Show. Molly Scotty from Northern Ireland. Johnny, how lovely to have you with us from Northern Ireland. Are you, are you from Belfast itself? Uh, I believe you've all been in strike. Am I right now? What about you? Uh, there we are, Dinky Do Shay, Dinky Do. Lovely to have you with us. I see to you. Fantastic. There, Shay has joined us. We love all that. Joshua as well, and Dexter has joined. This is great, guys. We can't be up forever. Can everybody get following, sharing, watching the videos? Tap, 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 de tap. Annie, thank you so much for the red roses. Annie has given me red roses. Uh, Annie, you've just got the number one gifter badge on TikTok. Is that not beautiful? Hi from Forfar, says Susie. We love Forfar. Yes, just Nefafi Dindi can and him starving him a frappe, a wee That would be nice. Or what a bit of Forfar Brady. Can a youth near a glams? There we go. Fantastic. We love you in Forfar. I remember um, talking to Dundonians and telling them Dundee was a parish in Forfarshire. Uh, I don't think, I think they were a wee bit dishuffed at that. Forfar is the senior town. I can remember being in Forfar and I needed to get some, I think it was some string or some wire for something. And I said to a gentleman, because everybody in Forfar was so beautifully dressed in those days with the tweed suits. And I said, um, do you know where I would get some of this? And he went, yes, so if you just go up the road, two or three shops, the town is stiff with ironmongers. <laughs> Have you still got ironmongers in Forfa? I love ironmongers. You go into the ironmonger and you hand them a wee something. You go, um, excuse me, would you have one of these? And they always take it and they do this, don't they? They go. It's a long time since I've seen one of these. They're, they're scarcer than hen's teeth. Just give me a minute, and then they come back with it. They go, there you go. That'll be um, 82p, please. <laughs> you never have a rounded figure in the Anmongers. It's always 79 pence, 84 pence for that. Thank you very much. You know, for goodness sake, take a quid. Uh, what Scottish place has a Russian name? Oh, I don't know, although I'm Russian at the moment. Because we're tight for time. See what I just did there. Uh, what has got a... Oh, Ayrshire has got Moscow. Moscow. Is it Moscow or Moscow? In Ayrshire, a wee village, a lovely wee village in Ayrshire is called Moscow. But when I have to leave, when I'm Russian, I always say, right, Moscow, see you later. Pablo, thank you so much for your beautiful gifts. Pablo's giving me red roses. Are you going to ski this year? No, Dominic. I only want skied. Linda sent me a TGIF. Thank God it's Friday. And uh, no, I only skied once. I put the skis on and stood up. And I hadn't had a chance to get my sticks. And I took off down a mountainside. And I thought, I don't think I could control this. It was quite a while before I fell over. So I got a bit of a shock. Well done. Fantastic knowledge, Jay. Did you like that? See, I'm not just an athlete, guys. I'm a black belt in karaoke. Pablo, what are you doing? Pablo is giving away all his life savings in red roses to Scotty McClue to that little goal there. Pablo, thank you, thank you, thank you. But you're very, very generous. And I want you to keep some pennies for yourself. I tell you, 1,300 likes. We once did a pop-up, guys, and got 30... 6,000 likes. And one morning, only a couple of weeks ago, I said, I doubt we'll ever beat that. 41 or 42,000 likes in an hour. For goodness sake, Pablo has sent me, oh, the best part of 60, 75 red roses. I do not know. You guys are amazing. Guys, I need another 20 followers on here. 
So get following, get spreading the word, tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Says Scotty McClue is live, big style, on TikTok. And people go, TikTok, TikTok's just a lot of we guys doing, no, 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 Scotty McClue. No, is, that wouldn't be the Scotty McClue. Oh, don't kid yourself. I say to you, well, good morning, Scotty lad. Chris, how lovely to have you with us. There's Ty, Pablo, thank you. So there we go, fantastic. Morning, Scotty, wish you were back on the radio. Can you wish Lini a good morning? Sedge, I can wish Lini an excellent morning. I tell you, Friday, guys, early ones is the one. Nothing gets past you, the one. It is an early, I say to you. Am I needing a wee trim, do you think? You see the hair, and it's getting a wee bit on the, the grey side. It was fine till this week. Do you remember West Sound Radio? Yes, I knew it very well, Chris. Um, I think I've even been on it at some point. Uh, so there you go. We've been, and I can remember Sydney Divine on West Sound. Fantastic. We love that. Who else was on West Sound? Was Dean Park on West Sound? There we go, down in Ayrshire. I remember when it launched. There we go. I got a freebie from the Iron Mongers and Paisley. I went in for a washer. The gent gave me six for free, Peter. Is that not what life's about? <laughs> they just, just take them. These were the days. Do you remember when we were went into the sweet shop and said, can I get a quarter of Russian camels, please? And the guy would put the quarter on it, throw in another two or three for the wee ones. Scotty, I love your hat. Where's it from? I'm sure it's from Primark. Oh, just did an advert for Primark there, but we love Primark. Um, no, this one came from Hogs of Fife. There we go. I tell you, I remember the Yorkers day. They just, just threw them in. And the shopkeeper always wore either a brown coat or a white coat. There we are. He looked like the doctor. Uh, fantastic. That was the stuff. And the penny tray. Who remembers the penny tray? Oh, wow. Was that not just amazing? We love the penny tree. I'm from Fife, Margaret. Shout it loud and proud. Guys, we'll get Margaret Fee Fife again. Fantastic. For part of Fife for you, Fee, uh, Margaret. You fee the Dunfermline, the St. Andrews, the Methyl, the Corcody, uh, the Wormit, the, um, the, 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 the Cardin Dane. Uh, for else have we got in Fife? Come on, guys, we all know. Are you freaking Ross? If you Falkland, Ken, you would be a great Doctor Who. Do you know, I actually agree with you. And I once did phone the genuine, real Doctor Who company at the BBC and say to them, any chance you could consider me for the Doctor? He went, an outside chance, but I'll have a look at it, you know, because I think McClure would make an amazing... Doctor Who. Lo, 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 I used to live in uh, Rosyth. I used to live in Kirkcaldy in the Langton, Margaret. Okay, walk along the prom there on a, on a bra day. Get a, oh, a bit of fresh air through the fourth. Uh, I can't a boy who, can't a boy who, can't a boy who lived in Kirkcaldy. Okay. Hi from East Lothian, Linda. We love East Lothian. I used to live in East Lothian. I lived out uh, at the Saltoons near Hayden. Ken, fantastic. Loved it out there in the North Berwick. Uh, I used to climb the law, climb the law on a Saturday, Ken, up to the whalebone and the wee hoose and had a look over the fourth at the, the Bass Rock. <laughs> Lovely. We love East Lothian and we say thank you to East Lothian for the joy that it brings to so many people. Lovely part of the world. Uh, there we go. Was Tommy Truesdale on West Sound Peter? I can't honestly remember everybody, but that name certainly rings a bell with me, I tell you. Uh, so there you are. Great. Uh, there was a great radio station, West Sound. Is it still going? I ask you. Uh, get following, guys. We need another... We had to do the math there, 29 followers. And we've got to go in about two minutes. How would you solve the Middle East, Scotty? I would withdraw all aid from both 
sides, nothing. Nothing coming from the UK, nothing coming from America. Say, so get round the table and we'll talk. I'll tell you how I would solve the Middle East and ask Mr. Trump to step into the Oval Office. Yeah, if I was the President of the United States, I would say, Donald, uh, Donald, can remember the second name. Oh, um, Donald, could you come in, please? Because we could actually seriously, seriously use you um, to sort out the Middle East, and it would stop tomorrow. Donald Trump's your man. Good man, I agree, dinky do. So there we are. Chill. Chill, how lovely to have you with us. Fantastic. Chill. I say, where are you from, Chill? What a beautiful name. Susan's dinky do. Kim's just joined us. Lovely to have you with us, guys. This is amazing. We're only here for another three minutes. Then I am going to have to take to my heels and take to the hills. The Trump bandwagon's rolling again, I notice. I know, Jay. Absolutely. I was watching the BBC's question time last night and they were all panicking about Donald Trump as if he wasn't just the finest thing since sliced bread. I mean, if they get Donald Trump in, they're laughing. He will save the world and he will sort out the evil ones. I'm from Puerto Rico, says Chio. Chio, how lovely to have you with us from Puerto Rico. Hola. You have a great day, Scotty. See Javaris, dinky do, dinky do. Where are you from, Scotty? I'm a, a Scotlanda. Scotland. Yes, indeed. That's the big bit in the north of Great Britain. Uh, fantastic. I like Trump, says Kirsty. I think everybody actually likes Trump. Some people just can't handle his bigness. But you need to be big to sort the world out. I mean, you look at America under Trump compared with now. How much are they paying uh, for a gallon of gas? I'm from North Carolina in the USA. We need Trump back in office. Susan, we need Trump back in office ASAP, I say to you. Guys, it's so, such a shame. I'm going to have to go in a minute or two because this is just beautiful. Scotty, do you think there will be war? There will be, Kirsty, if they don't put a stop to it. They need to put a stop to it. You see, all these bad things that are happening is nothing to do with incompetence. Well, maybe a wee bit in the UK, you know, but in actual fact, a lot of it's planned and there's a lot of evil out there. But remember, evil will always be triumphed by good. That's the history of the world. Everyone hated Trump. Now we're crying for him back. Yeah, I used to think he was a bit of a blowhard, but I look at the man. So skilled, so clever, so knowledgeable, so brilliant. And I think the sooner we get him in there, I tell you. God bless you, sir, says Susan. God bless you, Susan. And God bless America. God save America. In God we trust, I say to you. Uh, no profit in peace, Scotty. No, Peter, but there could be if they turn their swords into plowshares and their spears to pruning hooks, there could be huge profit in feeding the world. War, temporary profit, nobody ever wins. And uh, these, these guys are obviously in on both sides, I say to you. So once we learn to stop war and start feeding ourselves, there you are. And it's in Isaiah, so it's not as if Scotty McClure's just discovered it. Can you say free Palestine, sir? I can. And free Israel. And free Scotland. Free the world, I say to you. Follow us, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, and encourage everybody to share Scotty McClure. This is the biggest thing for you, I say to you. Uh, hell yeah. Thank you, my friend. No, not at all. Thank you. I say to you, so lovely to have you on here. And remember, Scotty McClure's been around a long time in television, radio. Yes, one of the biggest names in world media. Two billion people know me, but I'm not blowing because um, that means six billion don't know me. So we've got work to do, guys. You are fabulous, sweetie. So are you, Margaret? I say dinky do. Currently learning Tam O'Shanter, long, long one, a snowflake in the river. Beautiful. There we are. The hour approaches Tam Munraid. Oh, oh. Uh, 
and Maggie brought off her Maester Hill, but left behind her in great hill. Oh, Tam O'Shanter. Yes, when market days are wearing late and truthy neighbours and neighbours meet, I say to you, folk begin to tack the gate, that's it, and truthy neighbours and neighbours meet. There we are. We need Scotty back on the radio. Guys, I'll do you a Burns special. Time for a sip of tea every day. Quick sip of tea before you leap out the house. Do you like the mug? Bigger than my head. That's saying something, isn't it? You're no dafty, Scotty. Hawker Sidley, I love your name. Because I, uh, Tom Sopwith was the chairman of Hawker's. Uh, from the very, very early days, Harry Hawker, uh, the aircraft, and uh, Tom Sopwith was the chairman until the jump jet came in. One of the earliest uh, aviation guys. Stay, stay fabulous. What's the ship on your mug? I think it's the Cutty Sark. There are several ships on there, I say to you. There we are. In the 1930s, the Cutty Sark was out in the river because it nearly... My friend's boat, and it nearly collided. Yes, on a swinging mooring in Devon, I think, the Cutty Sark. Stay, stay fabulous, you two guys, beautiful people. Hashtag stay fabulous. Hashtag be kind. Nanny, Fee Tam O'Shanter is the figurehead in the Cutty Sark. Wow, Peter Heron, you are some man. That is amazing, and you're quite right. That rings a distant bell now that you've mentioned it. Yes, indeed. Yes, nursing her wrath to keep it warm. And Nanny was the wheel done cutty sock. In an instant, all was dark. <sighs> but scarce had Maggie rallied when oot the hellish legion sallied. Oh, it's all coming flooding back. I have to go, Scotty. Take care. Have a great day. See you, Virus. I have to go, too. Guys, have a beautiful day. Stay fabulous. Love you guys so much. Thank you for joining us this morning from all over the world. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 about Scotty McClue saying dinky-doo to every single one of you. Stick out your tongues, guys. Gathering our brows like gathering storms. Nursing our wrath to keep it warm. The hour approaches Tam Mon Ride. Ooh. Stick out your tongue and say ta ta, everybody. Love you. Ta ta. Ta ta. Once more. Are you ready?